Hi everybody, let's draw Angry Retsuko, the super cute red panda living a double life of a sweet office lady and a raging death metal fanatic. In my previous video, we drew nice Retsuko. Don't forget to check it out. Using a pencil, lightly, lightly, lightly sketch out the squash bun shape at an angle for her head. You want to mark the guidelines for her face like so, as she'll be looking up at the sky. Sketch some curved triangles for her ears and you want to space it is roughly one third. The ear further away from you can be slightly less than one third. Mark in the body with a more slanted rectangle compared to nice Retsuko. Place the hands and legs like so. Angry Retsuko will be holding her trusty microphone. Don't forget, the total height of the body should be the same or shorter than the height of the head. Now grab a pen or a marker. To make it easier, let's draw the parts that will overlap first. Draw a series of curved sausages for a hand holding the mic. Don't forget the little claws that come out when Retsuko is angry. The handle of the mic should be wider near the head of the mic and narrower at the tip. The other hand is doing a classic metal pose. Fill in the head and ears. Do only the top half and leave the chin for later. Raging Retsuko has her mouth wide open, so draw an X-shaped rectangle. Make this quite a thick outline, especially at the corners, to mimic the black lipstick worn by Kiss. In fact, I think Retsuko's look is very inspired by Kiss. Now you can draw in her chin. For the eyes, you want long teardrop shapes that are slightly slanted down. Use the guidelines to help you position them. Draw in the outlines of the eyeliner, they each have sort of three claws at the end. Time to draw the body. Again, using L shapes, draw her pleated skirt. Except this time, you want to fan it out a little into a sort of half circle shape to accommodate her lunging metal pose. For that proper angsty Red Skull look, you want to add some motion lines to simulate maximum metal. Maybe it's for the head shaking. Draw in a bunch of zoom lines around her eyes and ears. Try to keep them parallel. Carefully erase your sketch so you're left with the final art for colouring. Angry Retsuko is the same five colours, except it now has an extra three for her microphone and mouth. Use a darker red to draw zoom lines inside her mouth. Her eyebrows, when she's angry, goes from oval to a sort of tadpole flame shape. And don't forget that the white area of her mouth is still an egg shape. You see here, the white spiky pattern under her eyes really work because they look like tears of rage and angst. To make it look more angsty and dynamic, add more zoom lines using the head colours. You can also use white to add zoom lines on the features of her face. At this point, the drawing is done. However, if you want to go the extra mile and you're drawing digitally, you can add the red glow on her eyeliner and using a bright bright blue, highlight around her eyes. This gives her that extra angry glow. Now it's done! I hope you had fun watching this video. If you like this video, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button, share and subscribe for more cute drawing videos. Bye!